Hello friends, welcome to the class on computer aided engineering drawing. So in this video, we are going to solve a problem on isometric projection. The problem has been given like this, a sphere of diameter 50 mm rests centrally on top of a cube of size 50 mm. Draw the isometric projection of the combination of the solid. Okay, see we have a cube at the base which measures how much 50 mm. Above this cube, we are going to place the sphere. So this is what we have to do the combination of solids. Okay, for that, so first we think we have to we have to create a cube. Okay, so I'm going to take a line command. So always the thickness must be 0 0.13 in the case of drawing the isometric projection. So starting point of the line. So cube means all the six faces are equal of 50 mm. So so the length will be 50 into 0 0.816 enter angle will be 30 enter once again the length will be 50 into uh, 0 0.816 enter angle will be now it will be 150 degree enter now the length will be 50 into 0 0.816 enter so angle will be minus 150 degree enter then finally i am going to join it okay so this is how we have to draw the square now height is been given so before that we'll locate a uh, center of this object so take a line command so midpoint of any one of the edge and draw another line to the opposite midpoint like this. In the same way, I'm going to select the midpoint of an edge and opposite midpoint of the opposite edge like this. Okay, so now I'm going to take a move command. I need a, another copy of this. Okay, before that, so what is the height? It will be 50 from the center from the center so draw a line of length 50 into how much 0 0.816 enter okay so this will be the center so you can just choose the center line so it will be for our reference okay so a vertical line like this so next i am going to use a move command select this base of a cube okay now i am going to make a copy i need a copy of this so this must be in on condition so click for the point to move from hold this square from the center like this and click the point to move the element to so where i need to place so at the end of this axis i need to place it okay this slit so now take a line command draw the vertical edges from all the corners to the corresponding corner like this so it must be of continuous line continuous line from all the edges okay now the cube is ready okay now what we have we have a sphere of diameter how much 50 mm okay so we have a sphere of diameter 50 mm then what to do so first we need to locate the center of the sphere okay how to locate so take a line command so the line that you have to select is the axis line from the center of this cube, draw a line. How much? Because the cube uh, sphere measures how much in diameter? 50 mm in diameter. Now I need to locate the center of it. Therefore, I am going to choose 25 into 0 0.816. So that is a conversion factor from the actual scale to isometric scale. Enter. 
so angle will be 90 degree enter okay so i located the center of the sphere now take a circle command so there is a circle by center point so from the center of this sphere click okay so now so the diameter must be actual okay to locate the center we used to take a isometric scale whereas to draw the sphere it should be of actual scale that means the diameter is how much 50 enter okay so this is how we have to draw so this is a sphere so that must be a continuous line like this okay so now after drawing a cube and a sphere now it is the time to draw the visible edges so for that you have to from come from the top to bottom okay which is the topmost item we have we have a sphere so that will be dark okay so it must be dark of 0.5 now take a line command so now you choose a thickness of 0 0.5 see from this to here so it is dark so all these lines must be a continuous line okay so or else you can use another command called as split command i will show you so split click on the element to split i need to split this element okay you can just zoom this area so where you have to split you need to split this line where actually i have to split where this circle or a sphere intersects see here i have to split in the same way i need to split another line this is a line i need to split where i need to split where this sphere intersects with that edge into split okay splitting means we are going to divide the line okay so now you choose this 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 and this so this is the top face of this cube see that is dark okay now this vertical edges are visible so select this this one this one so this is also visible edges so it must be of 0.5 next uh, this object this element are visible so that must be of thickness 0.5 okay so this is how we are going to draw the isometric projections okay so next you can just uh, uh, give the measurement of this see this will be a actual scale how much is dia 50 okay i hope you understood thank you namaste